Now, some of the people in this room are my other grad students. Raise your hand, grad students. So, so, you know, several of you. Hello, guys. And they did the, the South by Southwest, the SXTX mm -hmm. State Project. Maybe just a few comments on what that gave you in terms of, like, not just going to South by. Yeah, 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 all three of you guys did. Not just going to South by, but, like, the project that we did. Yeah. Um, you know, when I was in, in that course doing the South by project, um, I had just wrapped up my stint as the editor in chief of the star and I just missed like, you know, doing like writing and making videos and, uh, you know, helping out with assignments. And so it was just like a perfect like bridge for me. It's like, yeah, I still get to do this. And so it was my, my first time at South by, I was just like blown away because it was, you know, it's like these people understand my language. They understand, like, I don't have to explain what Twitter is or, uh, or what Facebook is or, you know, web design and, like, you know, coding and why, you know, HTML or, uh, yeah, why standards are important, web standards. And so that was really eye-opening and really exciting for me. And, you know, it was just, like, a constant, um, you know, having to stay on top of your assignments and put out all this new material. But also, you know, on top of that, too, you know, I got to meet a lot of really cool people, like, um, Chris Anderson from uh, uh, Wired, um, it, we just like walked up to him and started talking and like just kind of freaking out because I'm like, I'm the editor in chief, like that's so awesome. And so, um, you know, just insane connections. And, and also, you know, I, I remember meeting the, some of the statesman people there for the first time, like uh, Omar Gayaga, who's our tech writer, and he's like, just amazing at Twitter. He's so funny. If you don't follow him, you should. He's Omar G. Um, and, you know, and Robert Quigley, and, you know, it was just a really cool experience. It's, you know, I get, like, just excited even <laughs> thinking about it. I love South by Southwest, and so it was a really cool project. It makes me excited to see all of them, like, so smiling when you even mention <laughs> South by Southwest, because that's what we want the students to come away from the project yeah. with, not like, oh, my God, it was so hard, that it was, like, <laughs> oh, this it was awesome so experience. Yeah. yeah, Carly, anything? Um, I think that South by Texas State was my first real awakening that all the stuff we were talking about wasn't isolated to Texas State. Like there was actually other people around the world that were just as excited about it. As Thousands of them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it was, you know, coming from a PR background, um, that was kind of my first experience, like having deadlines and like going to an event and then getting graphics or video from it and then immediately writing for it up and then pushing it out on Twitter. So it kind of gave me an idea of what Myra and, <laughs> and Mary do every single day, but um, it was overwhelming and it kind of made me realize that you can't just wait until software later to um, get caught up on what's happening in technology. Yeah. You have to be um, actively seeing what's going on every single day because you can't get it in you know, a 40 span. Mm -hmm. um, exactly what they said, but um, I guess with somewhat of a music background, when I heard South by Southwest, I thought music, you know, I, I didn't even, pay attention to the tech side of it. And when we started, the tech side of it had only been around a couple of years or so. A few years, but yeah. yeah. a few years. It was so yeah. we didn't, Much I mean, it wasn't really talked about as being so big. And now you look and it's gigantic. But um, it definitely was cool. I, I mean, meeting people in person who you've been following online or been reading their articles and just being in the same, you know, being on the, not the same level necessarily, You're on the same but level. in the same area. <laughs> That's um, what we prepare you to be on the yeah. same level with them, yeah. And um, I mean, it's of course great, great to come to Mass Comm Week and and, um, and hear about different things, but then going to the South by uh, panels is just another level. And you actually get to, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but you learn about SEO, what's SEO? Oh, okay, now I understand why that's important because it's related to every single website and everything driving traffic. And it's just on another level and it really pushes you to do your best because you want, I mean, you want someone to read the, whatever you did for South by Texas State on the website and be recognized for being a good product and being a good site. So. I mean, for me, it's like a, these are my people kind of experience. You yeah. know, you do feel yeah. very isolated, especially in the grad class. There's 10 of us sitting around a table talking about this stuff. None of your friends maybe care about it. Yeah. But yeah. you get to South by Southwest and there's 10,000 people there talking about it. And then for me, it's what keeps me up to date on, oh, they said something I don't know about, I better learn about that so mm -hmm. I can teach it. Yeah. You know, I mean, it's yeah. just, and, and it, I just get very excited during South yeah. by. It, it like kind of propels me for another year. <laughs> so. It's inspired. 
Yeah, yeah. absolutely. You see, you see a lot of cool things and a lot of stuff that people are doing because it's neat or cool or fun and not just because it's going to make money. A lot, yeah. a lot of it does make money, but you know, that's not often like the original Yeah, goal. there's a lot of passionate people in yeah. there. Yeah, and it's infectious, yeah. Yeah, absolutely.